What's up with y'all? Welcome to the Mo Squad Podcast. I'm here with Jay Renzo, Nick Camaro, 301 J, JoJo Easy. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned. Let's get it cracking. Stay no more is excellent. I'm gonna stay that way till the day I die. Give me a beat, I'm blessing it with my sick flow and fire rhymes. All these niggas copping me, all these niggas just be some minds. Hot, that ain't stopping me, it's more time. I'm still finna shine like the sun or a light bulb. Touch me and you'll get. Alright, so like I said, it's the Mo Squad podcast. Me and my boys and friends of over four plus years now since high school. And this podcast, we'll be talking about different topics concerning the generation and society of young people. And um, feel free to leave some comments or um, some thoughts or whatever um, other type of uh, topics you want, you want to hear from us. So we can um, have a broad range of topics for you guys. If we get like, comment, subscribe. In this particular episode, we'll be talking about social media influences on young people in this generation and how we can use it to our advantage and better ourselves and be more responsible while we use it. So we can't, we won't hurt other people in the process of doing our own um, little uh, social media things we like to do. And so let's get it cracking. So yeah, so I feel like. Social media is not the same as it used to be. Back in the day, it was like something fun to do. And pretty much everybody was like posting uh, funny stuff, comedy videos, stuff, meaningful stuff. And nobody's trying to like bash others as much as they do now. I feel like they, they use social media as more of a, a gimmick to like get to people and like get in people's heads and like try to throw them off course and throw them off their train of thought and their goals and their achievements they want to accomplish. So I feel like we can do better in general with being more responsible and being more careful what we post and how we use yeah, social media so facts. yeah we would think about that bro i definitely agree with well, mo you just gotta be mindful of what you're posting post something positive like what you're doing in community yeah. you don't always gotta post checking your ass or something like that like come on now just post something positive what y'all mm-hmm. think i agree i feel like doing it for like attention like, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah i mean yeah. nowadays people want to do it for likes but like they want to see like how many people view their stories how many likes they get on a post mm. or everything, you know? Yeah, yeah. They want to see what real. they can do, what they can gain for the most attention, you know? Yeah, yeah. definitely. You, know, you got to think about it. Uh, what is it? Take what your time. It? Take it's your time. A, it was a saying. I know it. What's it's it? Like something. What is it? Something like what? Something positivity. No, no, no. Wait, we'll get back to it. We'll, we'll get, get back. back to it. Do you know? <laughs> yeah, it will come to me. It will come to me. So I, I know. So how y'all feel about OnlyFans? Like, would y'all, y'all, y'all condone OnlyFans? Would y'all approve of that if you had a, a child or a daughter? No, hell no. Yeah, y'all no, wouldn't. No, hell no. no. <laughs> so like, I feel like OnlyFans, like, 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 like my friend, like my friend, I throw one. He said earlier, OnlyFans wasn't originally made for for pornography and stuff like that. It was raised for like content creators, like posting. Yeah, I did not know that. Yeah, I, I, I heard about that too. That. I, I didn't believe either, but yeah, it was originally. When I was um well when I was reading this OnlyFans was really made for content creators trying to broaden their audience and like a different um the different platforms for people like make content. But it's like only in the recent years as as far as it's been now, it's been used for like porn stars and like yeah. sex videos and stuff like that. Yeah. So like I think I I feel like if you if a if a young woman has to be subjectified to doing that just for just for the sheer money and like yeah. that much money, like and like me, you told them it's, it's not hard to get a job. Yeah, it's not it's that really hard not. to get a job. It's not that hard. Everybody needs jobs. Not that hard to get a job in 2023. But you gotta think about this generation. Like yeah. everybody don't really want to get a job. They want to like make money the easiest way possible. Want that easy money? Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. They, ain't like, they ain't got time exactly. working though. They got guys out. Yeah, they, they, they ain't got time working nine hours. Mm-hmm. Any publicity isn't good publicity. Yeah, so yeah. just because you you like the attention, don't mean it's good attention. Like yeah. they, 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 most of the only fans who be watching that, they can care less about the people. They can care less about as long as they real. see something that's, that's their their eyes are enjoying. They can care less about the person. Like person. The exactly, that's all, that's all they yeah. know too. And they about people like like content creators, like mm-hmm. maybe on YouTube, like yeah. how they raise in popularity, mm-hmm. and maybe because they did something like that so outlandish, everybody was like so surprised. And that's and what they're known for. That's, that's the only thing they're known for. Yeah. I'm saying like and now more people are trying to follow that trend yeah. to get the most outlandish, like crazy thing. Out yes, there. And now does that trend like more people. now does that trend like the stuff they be doing for attention, like it be it be stupid. <laughs> it don't be worth it for real. I was on this one video. I was on this one video. I was one video. This dude jumped in the fish tank at Bass Pro Shop. He got arrested just for. Oh, you I see saw that, that video? Oh, yeah. 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 It wasn't a bad pro shop. shop. This dude jumped in the fish tank at bad pro shop just for Instagram views, bro. He got, he got arrested like 10 minutes later. He took him out and put a handcuffs on I thought it was like at, at a quarter. I thought it was at like Disney World or something like that. That's, that's, that's the prime that's example. It's like, I thought it was somewhere. The challenges. You know, the challenges like the, the 
The milk crate challenge is all that. Yeah, that, 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 oh, that was during COVID. Yeah, that was. Man, man. He was so bored. He was, was so bored. Boy. Like, hey, you're trying to go to school with some dollars? Like dollar tree on milk crate challenges here. I like the fire yeah. challenge. All that. You probably should did that. He <laughs> <laughs> doing that shit. Man. Nowadays, I'm trying to gain like any attention. Yeah, clout. That mm-hmm. clout, but. It can it can go down any moment. That's what I'm you saying. You can be famous for like maybe a couple of months. A month, but after exactly. that, anything can happen. Remember, like no, nobody's nobody's indestructible. Y'all y'all are still human beings in the day. All y'all famous people out there, remember y'all are still human beings. Y'all y'all ain't y'all ain't indestructible. But I know y'all remember like back in the day that cinnamon challenge. Everyone yeah, that's tried to do that. What cinnamon challenge? They, they take a spoonful of cinnamon. cinnamon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you're you talking put about a swallow. We got to yeah. swallow it. It's impossible. Yeah. Like the cinnamon, it's consistency. You won't let you swallow it. Like old spoonful. Yeah, some people are dying. What was that? Twenty nineteen? Oh, it was. It, was, it wasn't that far back. It was. I don't like, recall that. I, I was like tenth grade, eleventh grade. Yeah, it, it, it was some like high school days. Yeah, like twenty seventeen. Twenty. Yeah, people died that stuff. Yeah. Only had Twitter and Snap. So I don't know. Only had Twitter and Snap and YouTube. So I wasn't yeah. that tech savvy like that. I mean, it's like. Because I'm like, this is, this is all good examples. So I'm, we're trying to <laughs> we're trying to get through y'all. It's like social media can be great. It can be a great tool. Great. Um, uh, way to relax, get some laughs out, enjoy watching videos with your friends, but like use it responsibly. Don't fall into the trap of trying to get noticed so bad that you put yourself at risk of harm and and being like ridiculed by like authorities, yeah. something like that. It's yeah. like so, some things aren't worth it for real. Like I know, I know yeah. the outcome can be yeah. rewarding, but the actual risk you're taking and the actual consequences you may face in order to just get to whatever you're trying to go, you're trying to reach. You can, you can, you can reach a goal during a safe way. Be, be ethical. My personal, I always try to be ethical. Everything I do, be ethical, guys. Don't be, don't be so quick to do some things just because you have an easy way of getting it. Be ethical. Be ethical all the time. And let me say this. People out there, please don't go on your phone like that. Try to talk to a person yeah. face-to-face mm-hmm. because this is crazy. When I used to work at Red Lobster, right? Yeah. People over there watching the whole damn movie. <laughs> and I'm just like, yo, you you at a restaurant, you're supposed to be talking to the person, not on your phone. Mm-hmm. It's ridiculous. I mean, it's sometimes I mean, people ridiculous. can't eat food while watching something. Like you gotta pull up YouTube, pull up a movie. You know. It's like why I just talk to a person, like it, it changed so much. Mm-hmm. Cause mind you, what? Early two thousands, we didn't have all this. We didn't have like really social media. Mm-hmm. So it's like, come on, y'all. Let's get back into actually talking to a person. Yeah, yeah. Actually getting to know a person instead of texting. And typing, it's like come that's on. That's what I'm saying. So like people like girls, I I I, I won't get this yet, but I feel like it's, it's need to say like girls, but they be judging, they be judging dudes' personality based on Instagram pictures. You know, you know what I'm saying? They be on, they be on. Nah, the, I never know noticed that. that. I never like they be that. like they be going to dudes' profiles and time. This is this. They think they that's what they like on social media. That's how they going. You know what's that? Yeah, because like they be like, ooh, how many followers you got? What's your principal like? How, how many people follow you? How many people I know follow you? Yeah, that's how they like, I never buy it like that, but you might be right. You might be right. Yeah. Might be right. Yeah. People is like that yeah. too, but we'll say that for leadership podcast. We'll yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, I feel like these days, like, and kids doing it too. Like young kids, not not thirteen, fourteen, like Yo. six, eight yeah. year old. Young kids I got a little bit too much access to the internet. They have too much freedom. Yeah, it's yeah. like I, I got a story. My cousin, she's seventeen now, right? Mm-hmm. She can be on her phone, tablet all day, just like that, 17? all day. 17? What the hell she doing with that at 17? But she always been like that. Like, yeah. she always been, like, tech savvy and on her phone. Like, but mm-hmm. that's what I'm saying. It's just like, damn, like, why we just can't talk to each other yeah. and actually play a game or see, oh, yeah, how you been doing in school? Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, okay, let me ask y'all this. Do y'all still sit at the, at, at the table? The family? The family? Yeah. yeah. With your yeah. folks? Yeah. Y'all do? For the most, well. Exactly. It's, 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 it's exactly. Like, it's, it's like, Who still sit at the table and actually eat without no 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 cell phones? Nothing. Oh, That's what I'm saying. Oh, cell phones, like I feel like cell phones are the best invention and the worst invention at the same time. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. I feel like sometimes I really wish like we were like back in the day, like. Like now, I ain't talking about like no stone age. I'm talking about like I'm talking about stone age. I'm talking about stone age. Oh yeah. I'm talking about stone age. Oh yeah. I'm talking about saying like back in the day when nobody had cell phones, everybody, everybody had to like do stuff more physically. We we, we couldn't just sit on our ass all day and like text people. We can like, actually go to the person's house or write them a letter or something like that. Like a ninety-year-old oh, letter. Write like, a letter. Like, yeah. It's like it's it's more it's, it's more <laughs> personal. Right it's more personal. You, you can like you know, imagine what they're saying for real. People won't do that when they're, if they're in jail. People do that if they're incarcerated. I'm dead ass, bro. I'm dead ass. I feel like 
it, it has to be more more connection than just like sending your phone, texting my message. You don't get to see a person's facial expression like that. You're gonna write a letter. You might as well just send an email. Like, that's, what, that's what I'm saying. Like email all that shit, bro. I feel like what I'm trying to say is like back in the day, we had to we had to be more like early internet. Well, not even, I'm talking about early before we even had internet, bro. I'm so I, 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 I would spend maybe a, if I got if I had a time machine, I would spend a week back in like say the the um the uh the post racial time the post racist time like like sixties and seventies just to see how it was like just to compare then then and now you gonna be there one day and come back like yeah, <laughs> you, you couldn't have said the eighties or nineties you you you, you said post racism sixties and seventies <laughs> I was like the eighties and nineties that would have been better that was saying right? right. but no nah, I'm serious bro I'm serious like I'm trying to say like without social media life would be very much different. Am I right or wrong? Yeah, uh, no, you're right. Be different. Okay. You're right. It, 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 y'all wouldn't even be able to recognize it without social media. That's what I got. Yeah, like, take these kids in like the 60s, 70s. Like, what, what's that? That's a typewriter. What's you that? Right. Huh? Do y'all have cell phones? No. So how do y'all talk to me? Y'all go to go to the neighbor's house, knock on the door, send them a detailed letter, get us a postman, drop us on my neighbor's house. Yeah, like. All right. Let me ask you that. You think kids of today are more privileged? Yes. They have technology. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I feel yeah. like yeah. It's the, yeah. I, I ain't gonna say it's the parents. So I feel like parents need to be more, more mindful of what the kids do. It's like these kids can do anything. Like they be like they can talk to anybody on the internet. They all you stealing cars, doing all that type of That's shit. What I'm saying. No guidance. Yeah. You know what I'm saying They're like sneaking. Sneaky, like, sneaky. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Be like, like, what are you going out tonight? Oh, hang on, my friends. No, she won't show a damn date with a grown man. Right. I'm just saying. <laughs> so I'm, I'm just like, saying. Like funny, but still, you right. Just saying. Right. Shit be like that, and man. That's sad. That's that sad. Back in the day, shit. That's sad. Like I feel like these kids, like I don't believe in beating my. Like, I, I, I always say I never gonna beat my kids, but I feel like y'all, y'all kids need to learn how to like be more cautious of what y'all do for y'all sales. So y'all can't be that. Y'all can't be that oblivious to danger. Y'all can't be that oblivious. Like yeah. we're, we're back in Stony, we were like we we're in the Ice Age. We had like a cave. Oh, we we're a caveman. Oh, if your mama you tell you don't go past the the river, it's a, it's a saber tooth cat over there, and it'll fuck you up. Would y'all would y'all go across the river? Probably not. It's the same yeah. thing. Same thing. If you if today if your mother says don't go don't go um out past the house or past the street lights, this is probably some people people want to be trying to hurt y'all. Y'all still go because y'all it's just want to. That you brought all. That's what I'm saying. Stone Age, like, like what? Still like we're still twenty humans. years ago. We're still humans. We're still I'm like humans. oh, come back right. before dark. You could say that. It's the years same ago. scenario. The same well, scenario. We came to Stone Age because nobody knows my, what, my, how, listen, how they listen, was living like. My point is like listen to your parents. My point is listen to your parents. Your parents say y'all shit for a reason. I know you know y'all always want to hear it, but they tell y'all shit for the reason because they probably been through it too and they want to make sure y'all have the best future for yourselves. Like they listen to your parents. I know your parents can be annoying, but listen to your parents. Respect your parents, kids. Definitely do. I hope, I hope, I hope that can work. Yeah. What you're saying, while I'm old, but I just don't know. I was trying to get the best going. analogies I could, bro. I was well, trying to get the I best analogies. Really something can't different. The Stone <laughs> Age. <laughs> I mean, right? It's like oh, this is, this is, this is. there are some bad parents out there. You yeah, I'm don't saying, wanna, like, you know, I'm, so for example, like I wasn't like. I, I would never do this to my son. Like they be they be recording their son. They they got like a bad report card. They've been like bad in school, bad. I, I, oh yeah, know. I've seen some. And, and they be like take him to the bar to get all the hair cut off because they've been bad. No, they be joking. No, they, they no, be dead they ass. They be they be yeah, slicing that shit off. But look, they be recording shit, put on social media. So you ain't gonna be bad no more, your son. That, that's, that's traumatizing. Like, yeah, my thing is, I, I'm gonna punish him like that. Don't record it, cause yeah. that just makes it much worse. And he, he can. Nah, it was all the internet for everybody. And like other, other platforms, that's gonna reach other platforms. So other people gonna post it. Like it's always gonna be there. Right. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They be saying like social media ruining families sometimes. Social media be ruining relationships and friendships and families sometimes. Kill people yeah. too. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, because yeah, that's a lot of bullying and all that shit. Yeah. And I was looking at something like a lot, like like two days ago or some shit. Mm-hmm. I heard about this Simone Biles or some shit. Yeah. yeah. Who's that? that? Who's that? She a uh, oh. Uh, 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 the gymnast? The gymnast. Yeah, yeah. Well, she, she, she won the yeah, the Olympic. What happened? So she's she married, right? She married to this yeah. uh, NFL football player, right? And then okay. they was, they was together in an interview and he said he was the catch. And a lot of women mainly got mad at that, that he said that. Why? He was the catch. Because he was a catch. Because he said he was the catch. Oh, okay. What you I mean? What, he, what, he was going to a lot of females? Like, He's getting cocky, were, cocky, cocky, cocky talking. Uh, something like that, but it's like he like oh like I'm the prize. It's like the woman say oh they're the prize. He say I'm the prize. You know. I mean nothing wrong. Like well, ain't, ain't nothing wrong. Nothing wrong with it. But at the same time, it's like they, they, it's mostly mostly so most times women be like that. Like if you say like I feel like as a man, if you say some some if you you can say anything almost like if you say it if you say it with ill intent or like an arrogant way, there's gonna be some backlash about you. But if you just say it from like just to say it because they're being honest and feel a better way about it. 
man, nothing really wrong with it. People probably will still look at you sometimes. Like, who cares? We've said intentionally to be arrogant. But like, I ain't hear about that. Weird. I ain't hear about I hear that. Weird, but like, this is a good example. I'm saying like, and this and, and social media, like, I feel like it's easier for women to like actually get more attention and stuff like yeah. that. Yeah, men, 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 we got, we got to do the, we got to do the dumbest shit just get attention. We are like, oh, that was the one we're taught. I guess they were taught about. I love this one dude. He, he say, what? I got name. He, he be, he be like doing back flips on microwaves and stuff <laughs> just to get attention. He be like doing back flips. He, he, he's, he's some white dude. I don't know his name, but like he be doing back flips on microwaves and barbed wire and Lego bricks just for money. He be you be going viral, you getting money off. He sound like jackass. Remember jackass? He sound like the the jackass people, man. That's what people try to do nowadays. They try to do anything for attention. All women got to do is pull the picture in the bikini. That's all they got to do, literally. All they got to do. Yeah, and that filter and be like a thousand lights. Exactly, and they have the camera like. Be like, who the? You like somebody different? Who are you? The woman posts a picture versus a man posts a picture like Instagram. Mm, yes, the woman most likely gonna get the most like. That's what I'm saying. It could, be, it could be the regular picture. Just, yeah, just simple fact. Picture, like the simple else. fact he's a girl. The simple fact it's a girl makes it a lot different. And all female rappers do that. Well, most of them do that. Most of them do that. Sexy Red, Megan Thee Stallion. I'm saying. So like, if you look at, so say, let's look at an example. So like, this is a, this young generation rapper. So let's say, let's say, uh, who's go, who's the artist to go by? Let's say Gunner. Let's say Gunner. Right. So like if he 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 could post a relative picture of himself like next to a car, yeah. maybe, maybe with some jewelry on, yeah, he'd probably get a man like like ten thousand likes. The sexy Rick, she, she can do the same shit and when you, doing the shit, the same thing as uh, um Gunner's doing. She get like fifty thousand likes. But see, and, our and mind is wired. She's a woman. She's a woman. Yeah, and our mind is wired. Like, come on, who would have? What man would not like that? Straight yeah. man would not like that. You know, yeah, you gotta be disciplined not like it. That's another topic. That's what I'm saying. Men like. We'll wait, wait to that later, but like, yeah, it's what I'm saying. Social media, like, it's, it's ruined. It hasn't ruined it, but like, it's, it's detrimental. It's, it's very detrimental. Yeah. To this society's yeah. young generation. Of yeah. People. Yeah. It's a positive and then it's a negative. Mm -hmm. Of course. Media. Of course. You just mm -hmm. got to be careful. Just careful what you post and like, don't be getting shit leak, leak mm -hmm. online. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Oh, yeah. uh, sexy red. That's it. Like, <laughs> told you about that, wow, well, mo. First of all, if you're, my, my thinking is, if, if you're a celebrity, why are you doing it? If you, if you know what you have at, at stake, if you know your worth, if you know how much like how much mm -hmm. stuff you got relying on you, why would you do something to, to fuck talk about all these videos? He's talking about yeah, that's not I something to be proud of. Famous. That's not something to be proud of. And I'm bro. just like that's not something. First of all, why, why would you say that shit on the interview, on public interview? Anybody can hear it. Right. I'm saying like <laughs> you just gotta be careful. You gotta <laughs> be careful. Listen, like these generation women, they be thinking like niggas supposed to. Like just go all out for them. I don't even know your last name. You expect me to check out how your fucking American bag. It's a lot we could go with. It's right. a lot. Right. Right. We coming for that, y'all. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we come for that. Come for that. Yeah. Boy, <laughs> uh, like during the holidays, right? I told my mom. I said, Mom. Let's not be on our phones, and then let's actually be the guys a family and play some game. Mm -hmm. I'm trying. I'm trying to tell y'all, we did charades, y'all. Yeah. We was we, we was actually into it. We did that probably for like an hour or so, mm -hmm. and that was the funnest thing I probably ever did with my family. Mm -hmm. and we had a fun time, and mind you, we had no phones. Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. If we could just do things like that, I think the world would be a better place. I really feel like it would. If we can't, if we could come together and actually. Not being on our phones, it'll be a better place. Yeah. I this, really do. I did the age, people can't put their phone down for more than five minutes. Everything, exactly. every, bro, some people, some people are very livelihoods in their phone, bro. Think about it. Yeah, people's whole livelihoods in their phone, so I'm trying to think. So, like, if you, if you rely on social media that much as a source of income or whatever you got going on, then, like, you need to make sure what you do is for your eyes only. Yeah. For real. For real. So like, like I said, back to Sexy Ray, like, I feel like, she shouldn't be telling the world about her business for like, yeah. And she got she, mm -hmm. me personally, I wouldn't. And my dog was on stage singing her ass, and she's pregnant. That's crazy. She's pregnant too. Bro. At the same she's time, pregnant too, bro. Damn. That's our generation. Oh, yeah. She's our generation. She is. I mean, yeah, she had 90s kids, but still, she our generation. And that's that's a sad part. Like, dang, like, why we just can't control ourselves and have some dignity? Mm -hmm. Like, she cool, but all I'm saying is just that. Let's just let's just have like a mindset and think on what we do and say yeah, yeah. because it can all affect it. Because yeah, uh, social media they would get on some press be like, hold up, what? Oh, she doing what? They doing this? You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's not even true. Mm -hmm. But that, but that's that's how it is now. Like people would just think 
what they thinking. It's not mm-hmm. the truth. Mm-hmm. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. Let me ask y'all this. What's that? If the internet just like stopped one day completely, right, for like a certain amount of time, mm-hmm. how long will you think it would take the world just plunge into chaos? The internet? Yeah, like it just stopped, like Wi Fi, everything. I give it a year. Ooh. I give it a year. I get. I get. I say shorter than that. I get a year. I give it a year. I say uh, at least a week. A, a week. week? Twenty four yeah. hours with no internet. Yeah. Are you talking about power and all that shit too? He did just the internet. Oh, no, yeah. no, not the power. Just like that's internet. why I said a year. That's why I said a year. You can... Oh, no internet. Yeah, like the Wi Fi stuff. Two days. days. Bro, two days. think about we were doing well without the internet in general. Then there's only rapping made like twenty years. Bro, I'm thinking about twenty five years. Generations. Yeah, too used to the internet. No, so yeah, we, we're, like, no, it's, we're too attached to the internet. So I'm like, yeah. there ain't no way we survive a year while of it. Like, it, it's going to be chaos. Yeah, I think we do chaos. Because if you notice, we need it for everything. Yeah. Yeah. Going home, GPS, we need it. We need like go to work, we basically. Do. Exactly. We do, we do work training. I mean, Uber, we need it. We have like, say you want to check what day is. You got to count on your phone. Exactly. Or check how with the words. Got on your phone. You ain't gonna go outside. Just look at your phone. You ain't gotta go outside. You need to look up something. All technology right there. So somehow it's not going to work. Tesla's, yeah. Tesla's all we that. We honestly thing. need it. We yeah. need it. So if we're too reliant. Yeah. If it was gone, man, I don't know what we do. We fly. I don't know. We say, we turn the savages. Like, to go away the internet, we be fucked. We turn the savages. We turn the savages. We purge. Probably do the damn purge. <laughs> I think we would. I think we honestly probably would. Have probably just. Apes together strong. Apes yeah. together strong. Plant <laughs> apes. <laughs> anyway, I think I think we'll probably like throw throw stuff into like Walmart and start uh, invading and get started. Oh, right. Yes, like how they did. Start looting. Start looting. Start looting. Yes. Start looting. Like in, um, Paris or they, 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 they were doing that. They were doing yeah. that sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it was because of strikes and shit. Yeah, mm. strikes and strikes. Mm. So, yeah. I don't think we would make it. We would not make it. No, I would. know I would. We, we would make it. it. We would make it. But Regardless. Like, no, no, no. It, wouldn't, it wouldn't be the same. No, no, no. See how hard that's like the car. No. People would be more, people would be more irritable. People would be more like uptight, bro. Nah. I'll tell you, man. People would do crazy stuff if they don't got the air in their Two weeks. Yeah. Two weeks. <laughs> I say a week at best. Not a Probably not even nah, a week. <laughs> not a week. Not a week because like we need it in everyday life. We don't have it. We ain't nobody. Well, that's a little. That's a little. Now, now, now you say you that. Know. That's why you saying like your whole phone is your personality. I'm saying we have a we have a brain. We have a I mouth. Mean, we, have a, we have a we have a if you think about we have a it, way of communicating. I mean, in hey, some cases, there are some few out there. Well, human beings saying cannot function while phone. Bro, yeah, look, bro, look, bro, look, think about yeah, it. it. If y'all if y'all realize the world is bigger than just America. So, some people who have gone their whole lives without even knowing what the phone is. All right, how about this? Right. The Western world will exactly. not survive without the internet. The West, yeah. If you go to like Africa, if you go yeah. places like some, some some third world country, they, they don't give a fuck about the internet. They don't. Amish people, too. Amish people. Yeah, they don't know exactly. that, too. So yeah. you're right. You're right. They're they doing so, fine. Sometimes we forget the world is bigger than just America. Exactly. The world is bigger than just America. Because like some places, they don't have it and they're doing fine. Mm, yeah. Shoot. My day one stepfather, he came there in the 70s. And mm. he was 22 when he got his first TV. Really? Yes. Damn. Damn. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> so that's what I'm saying. People can't. I mean, some people can do it in other countries. They can. I didn't think about that. That was a. That was that's a what I'm point. saying. Like y'all be y'all be forgetting that America is one part of the world. The world is yeah. huge. The world is huge. That's why yeah. everybody can say it's got to either travel, get out of your comfort zone, to explore what other people like. Exactly. You know what we, we, that's what I'm saying, bro. We got travel. We get people travel. take what we have for granted, and they, they don't realize that a lot, a lot of people don't don't need all the shit that we need to survive. They don't need it. They don't need it. Yeah. I don't know how we do it, but they're they they're it. they're adapted mentally and physically to not be needing technology, internet, heat, so yeah. like that. Yeah. And some people still practice hunter gatherer lifestyles. Some people like that. Yeah. Like. Camping would be hard for me. I mean, remember we did, did camping? Camp. Y'all, y'all, y'all didn't last a day. Y'all, y'all didn't last two days. I'm already used to it. We already rang, so we wasn't going to. Yeah. You, you didn't last two days. We didn't, y'all last two days of camping. Y'all didn't yeah. last two days. Y'all, y'all got, we, got, we got the hell out of Dodge. We got the hell out of That's Dodge. That's what I'm saying. And it was tough because we didn't have like no activities for us to do. We can go off that yeah. fishing pond. He walked to that bar. Bail was yeah, dying. Yeah, we didn't have no gate <laughs> on like that. We don't speak on that. Right? Yeah, Bail was passed out. So. <laughs> Yeah. Was Michael Woods? You was too. No, I didn't care about it. Oh, there's us three. Damn. Yeah. Michael Woods, that's right. Damn. Yeah. I like yeah. we, we were doing for two days, but man, we tapped out on day two. <laughs> Don't say me. It was all of us. Yeah. My mom come pick us up. 
Yeah, it wasn't. Where, where did y'all go? To? We went to Brandywine, Cedarville State Forest. Oh, okay. Brandywine. It, it was actual camping ground, but these niggas ain't last to eat. Damn. That forest, that's a good little park. I mean, I mean, you, you walk two miles under the heat. I had to sleep on gravel. Right? So did I. You ain't fucking so did I. Like rocks under me. So did I. So did I. Bro. I could not sleep. And this nigga brought a low ass dog. He brought Jesse. He brought Jesse. And they, was, they survived somehow. It was different, but I would do a cabin with technology. That's just me. It was so different. It was like it was like what grand, for a whole day. Was so, it was it gonna be bears, grandson? It's gonna be bears. It will be bears. It's gonna be bears. But but that's what I'm saying. What could we do for a whole day without no technology? What can we get do? back to nature? I couldn't think. Get back to nature. I don't know. I mean, you I, 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 I personally was I mean, trying to draw, but I never got the chance to do so. Draw. Oh, yeah. yeah, you brought a little sketch. Yeah, I brought my little sketch, sketch pad. But we gonna do? You know what I'm saying? What we gonna do? I'll be That's fine. I'll, I'll be carving. I'll be carving. Just need to do. I'll be yeah. carving. I'll be making stuff. Jern- journaling. Yeah, you draw- yeah, yeah. Bird watch. Like, like, you need more people. Things. You need more people to entertain yourself. I mean, three people was cool, but you need like a whole. That's, yeah, that's a good point. Like, I was watching. I was here. Somebody talking about somebody getting a lecture. They said. Like a person living on living by himself his whole his whole life that he wouldn't survive long. Yeah. Well, human beings are social creatures. Like we need we need social interaction to be yeah, to keep do. sane and to be healthy in we general. Do. We do. Like we we, we couldn't survive, but we're not meant to be alone. We're not saying like, somebody like some animals that they're meant to be alone. Like some animals like they're naturally known to be alone. Like I can't I can't think of what he does right now, but like human beings um, what? Yeah, well, t- yeah, tigers. Like some animals are actually known to be comfortable being by themselves, but I'm like, we're, we can't do that. We're not, we're not built to do that. We're human beings, so yeah. we have to. If we don't have social media. We have to entertain each other, but by just being ourselves. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what the hardest part. Like, I was trying to think, what can we do that whole day? But then, but then uh, it was raining. You called your mom, but if that didn't happen. What could we do? Think about walk it. What that could pond we again. Do? Walk to the pond again. Oh, I'm not doing that. Not <laughs> that with that white lady, y'all you're gonna try to go back there with us? Please <laughs> don't do that, y'all. It was no. 85 degrees, bro. That was a two walk. mile hike to a fishing park. They catch shit. Don't, do they that, catch shit. don't go camping in August, all right? Yeah. That, that was in July. That, that, that was August. July. That was August. Yeah. That was late July. That was like July really? 29th. Yeah. We, we just came back from Oakland City. That's what I'm saying. It was oh, July 29th because it was, that was my it, it was still hot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it was still hot. Yeah, that's, that's yeah. it was right, still hot. Okay, man, between July and August, all right? So September at, September. The, at the most, at the highest September. And you do like, like, yeah, like air because I don't know. Yeah, air conditioning. Get an RV. Get an RV. Get a trailer. Get a trailer. I'm not gonna get no tent, man. I'm not. I'm not that dude. You set us up too. You huh? set us up. Set that up. Like, it worked. The tent worked. You set us up. We're, we're getting off topic. We're getting off topic. We're getting off topic. <laughs> we're getting off topic. <laughs> we're off topic. But anyway, yeah, so what we're trying to say is like, without without internet and social media, we would our society right now we wouldn't we wouldn't be as effective at doing stuff as we are now. So we have we have to find new ways of staying sane, and entertain each other without comedy videos and internet, Instagram reels and stuff like that. So yeah, I feel like we just we need to like come back and really reset. Our situation right now because we we live in an era of technology and sometimes we use that we we, we abuse our privileges exactly. yeah, we abuse our privileges you said it right we abuse well, our privileges said it right yeah. you definitely let me right. ask y'all this yeah how long do y'all think y'all spend time on your phones on like average a day? a day yeah on average in hours I say maybe three three and a half hours four hours if, if, it depends on the day too it's like I feel like if I'm if I'm tired I, I would stay on long but I think the average like three and a half hours for me. Nobody just just it. phone time. Dang, that's a good question. If you guys are not texting in the chat, <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe like an hour. You know, actually, a whole day. A whole day? Really? You? Yeah, but like I'll be off and on because, like, look, I've been on YouTube all the time. So I've been watching all my videos. But mm. dang, yeah, it probably maybe a couple hours. Mm. Sad to say, because when I get up in the morning, I'm on it. Mm. I should even be on it. I should I should be praying. That's just me. But I should be praying and do what I gotta do. Yeah. But once I get on it, somebody saying something or like it's like you, you gotta get on it. Yeah. Makes sense. What about you? I, I'm gonna say like a couple of hours because I used to be on like well obviously Instagram. But also do do really like scripts and something like that. So it's like help me improve my writing skills mm-hmm. and reading skills and all that. So I'm gonna say a couple of hours for me. For, for, That's what I'm for saying. Me. So like we me four to five hours because mm-hmm. um, i do different things like whether it's, let's say if i'm not doing anything like staying home all day be on a game or 
You know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like YouTube videos. You a gamer? Yeah, I don't want to talk about the game. You a gamer? I tell you, you like, that joke. I'm saying like people, people oh, like nice. people have different. I'll, I'll get into it. People have different viewpoints on how beneficial video games are. They be saying like waste of time. Some people be like it's good for teachers' patience and hand-eye coordination, stuff like that. It, it all depends on how how you do stuff and how yeah, you absolutely. how you interpret what you're doing for them. Mm-hmm. I know some people. Some some like I said. To be fair, gaming. Is a is a multi million dollar industry. Like people, people can become millionaires by designing games, but like you got to make sure you have to know how to survive in the real world, as well as being yeah, a, a being a good God, gamer. Uh, you can be on your game. Like, Mario Kart ain't real life. You can't do Mario Kart in the street. You can't be doing Mario. Actually, GTA, you nah, that'd be fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Hey, sometimes if you be coming on the roads, man, I just want to be throwing like a red shell. Oh, like banana that, peel, you know? banana peel, banana peel. That's what I'm saying. Nah, you yeah, like, like I say, you gaming all day. You don't have to get outside, take, like touch some grass. Like, <laughs> yeah, you touch some grass. You can't be gaming like twenty four seven. Yes. All right. I used to be like that, yes. but I was like, I can't do you that. You can't do that because you, you, people can die like that. If you sit for too long, you won't, your, your blood can stop. And like your, yeah. it was, it was a commercial a thousand ways to die. Okay, okay. I remember that show? I get it. Okay, 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 okay. okay. I, I can't even want to remember that show. I get that. it. I get yeah. it. That show was special, was crazy. What? Yeah. Was funny. <laughs> it was remember funny. y'all? Remember y'all? When we was kids, right? And everybody playing outside. That was the thing. Yeah. My neighbor would be like, "Hey, hey." Those times are hard to find out. Outside. Those, those times yeah, are hard to saying. come like across. Kids again. being outside those playing basketball for like all day. You know what I'm saying? Be outside all day, just having do your homework, get to get that shit done. Go outside, do your homework, get that shit done out the way. Missed it. You came home from school and you just got you didn't have no one where you went outside. All your friends, can Will come outside to play? Can Jerry come outside to play? Exactly. Those are those are times we long for. And now you don't see that at all. Ain't nobody outside. Ain't nobody outside. Nobody. Like, hey. No, only people that say like little little kids, like six, seven, six, yeah, five. Yeah, walking. But yeah. it's crazy, man. It really is crazy. I really, I really miss those days. I'm, yeah, little, little person. I'm happy yeah. we we got to experience that when it was exactly. good. Yeah, when it was exactly. good. So some, exactly. some people, some kids, like younger generation, they don't, they don't know what that's like. Yeah. Is it sad? But some oh, no. some people don't know yeah, what it's like. Yeah, to, they don't even know how to ride a bike these days. Fortnite. They don't know how to ride a bike these days. Yeah. 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 On the iPad. That was a culture reset. Yeah, that was a culture yeah, reset. Struggle, man, yeah. just go outside, so come back inside. So you had to get the the hose ready to war, right? Yeah. <laughs> no, no in and out. No way y'all stay outside. Y'all come in the house. Yeah. Keep, keep going in and out of the house. That's what I'm saying. I mean, that might be just a like a black people thing, but you know. Yeah. That's what my brother. Yeah. He takes his kids out maybe like maybe once a week to the playground. Because they need it. Yeah. Humans need it. So yeah, you know, yeah, major, you know you humans be, need humans need, need that. Need we, air. Yeah, we need well, not even air, well, we, we, we need we exercise. But yeah, we need, too. We need yeah. exercise. They get out of air. I mean, we we, 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 we <laughs> dead without air, but we will be dead without air. I mean, <laughs> sunlight and carbon dioxide. Yeah. You know? I mean, oh yeah, so yeah. Let's, let's let stop breathing air for a second. You know what I mean? die. It will die. We just we need we need we need enrichment. We need enrichment. We need enrichment. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like when I have kids, my kids will not have like a self. I say, I say, I I, I get a phone at twelve. I I'll give my my kids a phone at twelve. Twelve. When did y'all I, start having your first phone? Twelve, thirteen. I had a BlackBerry. I had a BlackBerry. Yeah. I had a twelve years. I had a BlackBerry. I had like a flip phone. I was like, we had a flip phone. Yeah, we had a flip phone. I didn't get like an actual phone to like ninth grade. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, that's, like, and that's good like, for real. Like, that's good for you. You learn basic skills and social skills when you don't have a phone. And that you can't be walking down a busy street, low doing this shit the whole time. Yeah, they're gonna, they <laughs> they gonna tell your ass up, bro. Rob, 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 <laughs> rob, <laughs> rob. Like, what happened? You're walking. Oh, you can't be like on your phone and just like texting and driving. You can't that's what I'm that. saying. Yeah, even Ooh. even walking. Ooh, that's a that's a good one too. Texting. Ooh. Like they, people, yeah. people they got people gotten too comfortable with text and drive. Like they be those those, those commercials need to come back. Those commercials need to come back, Jerry. They need, they nah, need to come back. They need to come back. They need to be putting a little big commercial all the time. They put the text and driving yeah, words back. I agree. That driving school though will not be um, emphasizing enough. Yeah, be getting in people's head because mm-hmm. y'all see it. Yeah, you pay attention. People would driving and texting. Absolutely, you know what I'm saying? My family member, he over here. We in the uh the van? No, we in the van. No, we are here in the highway, right? Mm-hmm. And there's a lot of traffic, right? But he okay. over here watching Instagram. Who's at that? Instagram. Who? I'm not seeing no names. Okay, he watching Instagram. Why you driving? Yeah, 
Eric? Was it Sarek? Was it Sarek? I'm not saying no <laughs> names. Saying no name. I'm, I'm, sorry. I'm, sorry. I'm not saying no names. Anyway, she over here driving. I'm just like, yo. And I'm just like, I never want to do that. That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm I, I, him I always to told myself. That, always, I always told myself when I when I have a car, when I start driving consistently, I'm on. I'm gonna turn my phone off, put that shit in my pocket or in the glove compartment. I ain't even gonna think about that shit while I'm driving. I ain't gonna think about it. Unless I'm using like Google Maps or something like that. But even then, I won't be texting you. Call it maybe. I won't be like doing this shit while I'm driving. I know it's dangerous. It's tough. You're putting man. yourself and other people at risk. Don't be doing that shit. You should you know. Can, you you, you did that shit before. You did that shit, Jalen. Yeah. You, you ain't innocent, bro. Yeah. Texting your, your girlfriend while you're driving. You got a pull, okay? I text real quick. FaceTime it all the time. You remember, bro? You remember, bro? Y'all trying to get locked up. That's crazy. In general. You know you be doing that, Jay. No, no, no. I, I ain't saying that. no more. I ain't saying no more. I'm talking about used to. You ain't doing yeah. no more. You know. It's probably a lot of noise. <laughs> legal reasons, this is a joke. This is a you joke. haven't been doing that, okay. all right? Legal reasons yeah. is a joke. He, he's a, you can't erase a veteran. He's a veteran. Y'all can't be doing stuff. Wait. I don't even know that. Right. <laughs> but just people, put the phones down when you drive. Just put it down because that phone ain't going nowhere. Your life yeah. is... It, your life is there. Yeah. That phone still gonna be alive and still gonna be kicking. <laughs> but you're like, not. You can see. You can see how POV is had this whole like, uh, like eighty five like minutes. They be checking their phone, see if they got a notification. That's what I'm saying. It's not that serious. Like you, you have a notification. Like, I understand if it's you have a person. sound no more reason. You, 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 you get a notification, you can hear it. You don't gotta be checking every five minutes. I'm saying if it's that important, then you you need to reset the situation. For real. It's tough. I know it's told the people because it's just that's all they know. But somebody, mm-hmm. if, if somebody texts just anything, you gonna be like, oh, so I got or like FaceTime. You gotta look. It's not that important. Like they can wait. They're not gonna not gonna pass out for the most part. They're not gonna dive and don't respond like five minutes. Just tell a person, it's, uh, hey, I'm, I'm gonna call you right back. I'm driving. You like, okay, I understand. Yeah, it's easy to say that. Just say it. Yeah. You don't gotta. You don't gotta just be talking the whole time. You got people in the car and they look at you like, hey, man, what you doing? That's what I'm saying. I'm saying. So, Michael, how you feel about? Um, so, you, you think that social media? You think people can use it better than they are doing it right now? Do you think they can like flip it to be more positive, be more like uh, use it better, use it more responsibly? How you feel about that? Would you Would you want your kid use social media in a negative way? No, I wanted to use like use in a positive way, not like negative ways to like get attention or yeah. or whatever they feel like down or whatever like mm-hmm. yeah, I, was, I, was, I like to say I like to say like, so social media you don't have to look at social media value just so you can yeah. but look in the mirror if you if you know you're what you're about you got some discipline about yourself you know who you are you don't gotta like get social media approval for nothing in your life bro. Don't, the hard part about that is like you got people who have like low self esteem yeah that's what i'm saying and they go on like they go say you go on instagram right say you see someone same age as you like like twenty in the twenties, mm-hmm. they already got a house. They got, they already got a car, money they got like that. They do all that uh, shit. Yeah, and you look at yourself like, well, how come I ain't got that? You know what I'm saying? That's it's like it just pours down on you. Like that's the main problem with me. You know? Y'all be y'all be comparing yourselves to other people. Y'all ain't y'all know shit about them people. Do focus on better. Be the best you you can be. Be the best you can be, and then everything will fall into place. I swear to God. The only person follower. in the race is you. You're racing against yourself, not other people. Don't be a follower. Mm. Don't be a follower. Be, be a leader. leader. Be a leader. Be a leader. One, it's on one to three. One to three. Be, be a leader. leader. Yeah, be a leader. Yeah, so I'm saying like y'all know you know you know people, especially women. Y'all have to go to the media like to value. So those people on the media don't don't know you for a can of paint, and you 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 take their opinion more seriously than your own friends or family. Don't don't do that. Exactly. Don't do that. Don't do he'll that. be he'll be taking those comments seriously. Be like, oh, I'm like. Yo, they don't know you, so don't, don't know get you. into that. Right. right. <laughs> that's the best. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. the first comment. Like you having like never most of the in real life. That's what I'm and saying. And not being confident in themselves, you know. Because like, I felt that way before. Like yeah. in the past, I felt like I had low self esteem, but I, like I like gained my self esteem, gained my yeah, confidence. Exactly. So I can understand how people are gonna feel like that. Exactly. So it's like it, you can't just say like, oh, you can be more confident. So yeah. You gotta, Finding in their soul to be confident instead of like, you know. Exactly. You know who you are. God has blessed you and you can do whatever you want to be, but don't let these comments affect Please you. Please don't. Please don't. Don't, don't do it. Please don't. Because you are wonderful and you are an incredible saying. person. That's for anybody. I'm anybody. Saying. And someone hates you for no reason. Don't know. They got a problem. They got, they got a problem with themselves. Like, Unless you're doing something that, that. that game team, then that's a That's what, what if, if you're doing, if you're trying, look, if you're trying to do like, I'm saying these upcoming rappers, if you're trying to do something, you trying to better your craft. You're doing something right now. You may not be the best at it, but if you're trying to go somewhere with it, you're not gonna let people distract you and like people bring you down with negative comments and uh, commentary on your videos, or whatever. Like, don't don't do that. Like, do it for yourself. Don't do it with noise approval. Do it for yourself. 
And if you, nobody else likes it, make sure you like it, and that's all that matters. Don't let people's yeah. thoughts about you affect you. Yeah, because like yeah. they don't know you. Most part, they don't know you. All you know, I know is like what you're doing, and you're doing it for you're doing it for yourself. You're doing it for them. You're doing it for yourself. You don't got to die over that. You don't. You, you don't. don't. Yeah, you, you have so much to live for. Don't. Mm-hmm. Don't. Mm-hmm. Forget the comments. Forget, how, forget the comments. How we look on time, man? How we look on time? Uh, no, I think we should start like wrapping things. I figured that. Yeah, guys, got final thoughts. I don't say that. Yeah, 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 any final thoughts, anybody? No, not really. Uh, okay, well, me. Right. Y'all, mm, I'm trying to think real, real calm you on this. But I just want people to just know that you don't have to do it on your phone so much. Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. Just talk. Get to know a person. Mm-hmm. Know who the actual person is. Mm-hmm. And that's all I got to say. Just My, my yeah. thing is, don't compare yourself to other people to me, especially if you don't know the person personally. The only person you need to be worried about is your own person, your own account, your own profile, and don't be trying to like um, overthrow somebody you don't know personally. Just because that person's doing better, it don't matter. All right, y'all, that was the Most Squad Podcast. Thank y'all for tuning in. More videos on the way. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, give us some comments on topics I wanted to discuss. Y'all stay blessed. Enjoy the rest of y'all day. Most Squad, we out. Peace. Live yeah, well, yeah. we out. Do the no more is excellent. I'm gonna stay that way till the day I die. Give me a beat, I'm blessing it with my six glow and fire rhymes. All these niggas copying me, all these niggas just be some mind. But that ain't stopping me, it's most time I still finish shine like the sun or a light bulb. Touch me and you'll get burned.